Collingwood versus Brisbane in the 2023 AFL Grand Final. Two of the AFL heavyweights ready for battle. Let's ring the bell. Ding. Some of the biggest battles ever fought 20 years ago happened during this week. Voss versus Buckley, Brown versus Richie Cole, NSYNC versus Backstreet Boys. It all was out of control. In the black and white corner, with a 2023 season record of 18 wins, five losses, originating from Victoria Park, Victoria, and now residing at the MCG. This is the Craig McRae led. Collingwood Magpies! And their opponent, out of the maroon blue and gold corner. They had a 2023 season record of 17 wins, six losses. Originating from Fitzroy, Victoria, and Carrara Gold Coast, now fighting out of Brisbane, Queensland. They are the Brisbane Lions! Lions. Let's check out the tale of the tape. The number two ranked offense versus the seventh. The number three ranked defense versus the fourth. 35 to 37 players used. An average winning margin of 32 points compared to 28. Average losing margin of 25 points compared to 22. And the Brisbane Lions have won the last six in a row. Two contrasting styles, carnage versus control. The Pies love to run and gun, starting their attack from the half-back line and then streaming through the middle of the ground. This has been their knockout punch all season and one the Brisbane Lions need to be aware of. More how Quainara Maynard generate the drive that has provided the Pies so much success in 2023. Collingwood's goal scoring accuracy is a league leading 55% over their last five games, a beat being 18th in the league for forward 50 entries, averaging only 40 per game. It doesn't go in as much as Brisbane, which is 58 entries per game, but they make the most of their opportunities. When the Lions took control against the Blues in their preliminary final, it was due to kicking their way through the defences and not giving them a chance to set up behind the ball. Getting the ball into the multitude of forward threats is what Brisbane will have to do quite quickly to make sure that the Collingwood back line are caught on the hop. Brisbane love quick entries, winning 32% of their offensive one-on-ones compared to Collingwood's 20% over the last five games. It's imperative that Brisbane start well in their offense and their defense. They need to be fast and the furious, just like Paul Walker and Vin Diesel. They need to top the number one first quarter team in the AFL in 2023, as well as scoring themselves, as they have a habit of fading like a flower rock set style. They almost coughed it up last week in the final quarter against the Blues and we know that the Pies never retreat never surrender attitude has resulted in 59% of their final quarters won in 2023 alone. Brisbane are at 48%. Collingwood need to ensure that their half back line doesn't get locked into their own forward 50 as they do find it challenging to get an outlet. Brisbane like to get it into their forward 50 quickly and have their mids and backs push up to lock it in. And when you have Charlie Cameron, Zach Bailey, Jared Lyons and Cam Rayner contesting harder than anyone in the AFL inside 50, Collingwood won't have it easy. Now we know Jordan Dugowie and Joe Danaher can be the X factors for this game and they can win a game off their own boot. But I believe that the biggest X factor of this game will be the heat. Melbourne is it going to experience a 29 degree day in September potentially going to be the hottest grand final since the 1987 Hawthorne versus Carlton game. And in those days, they were in the woolen jumpers. Brisbane are used to the warmer conditions where Collingwood aren't. They, they might have the Collingwood army heating themselves up every week, but the temperature is going to be scorching and they don't want to be burned alive. So, will the Brisbane Lions or the Pies be cooked by the end of the fourth quarter? It's a fascinating twist and one that may shape the result of the game. So who wins? So when I take everything into consideration, I'm leaning towards the Brisbane Lions winning the 2023 AFL Premiership by a margin of 24 points. Their highly potent forward line is going to cause issues for the Collingwood backs and their multitude of goal scoring options is going to be difficult for them to contain. And with the loss of Dan McStay, I think that's going to be a gap even Billy Frampton won't be able to fill. And the Norm Smith medalist, don't forget that, will also be from the Brisbane Lions. And I'm going with a bit of an outsider with this one. I'm going with the big boy, with the sexy mo, Joe Danaher. If he gets off the chain early and sets himself up for a big final, not just in front of goals, but around the ground and his tap work, he's going to set the Brisbane Lions up and he's going to have a magnificent little medal hanging around his neck. So what do you think, viewers? Am I right? Am I on the money? Let me know. 
in the comments below. So there's our 2023 prediction for the AFL Grand Final lace out style. I hope you like it. I'm Peps, and it's how you want your footy.